guys welcome back to my channel matter of fact happy new year I haven't seen y'all since <laughs> last year I'm back <laughs> anyways thank you for tuning in I know you guys have not seen me in such a long time and we will get into that right into this video. Um, <laughs> I love you guys so much. I want to wish you all a happy new year, a peace and blessings, all that jazz. Let's get right into the video. This video is going to be lengthy, is going to be a chit chat. Uh, everything that's been going on, why you haven't seen me, what you will expect in my my videos this 2018. So I suggest you get yourself a cup of tea, some tequila, or like a big bottle of water. This is sparkling water. I bought the wrong one from Whole Foods, but I'm not going to waste my money, nor am I going to go all the way back. Nor am I going to go all the way back to Whole Foods. So I'm just going to drink it. Cheers to you. Ugh. I don't know how people drink sparkling water by itself. Like, oh my god. Yes. Um. So how have you guys been doing? How was your Christmas? How was your New Year's? Like... What did you guys get up to? Me, for Christmas, I went to Swanee, Georgia. If anyone is from um, Georgia, especially Swanee, Georgia, leave comments down below. I was in your neck of the woods um, this Christmas season with my family, um, with my mom, my brothers, Terrell Tyrone, and my little sister, Brianna, also my stepdad, Wayne. And we just had our basic Christmas in which we just, we kind of just hang out. Uh, we love on each other. We talk about like past stories as usual. We also deal with like any drama that needs to be dealt with between the family. We kind of handle it right there. Um, so yeah, that's how I spent my Christmas in Swanee, Georgia. Which actually, it sounded really country to me, but it actually is not that country. It's more suburbia-ish, but it's not that country. So, I mean, I can't stay in quiet for too long, but it's cool. And for New Year's, I actually went to church this year. Like, your girl went to church. Like I said that I wanted to start the New Year off kind of in a good um a good for forward in a good step i haven't been in front of the camera in a while so if i start start you guys know i already stuttered but if the stuttering gets really bad it's because i'm a little nervous because i haven't like recorded like literally i have videos that i haven't edited on my camera from when i was in Atlanta, uh, georgia but I haven't sat in front of the camera in like forever, bro. So it's a little awkward to me, but I'll I'll get used to it soon. Anyways, so I went to church. Um, I usually sit home or for the past few years I've been just at home, but I wanted to start off the new year kind of getting on the first track with my faith because for the past few years I've my faith has not been strong I've questioned um God I've questioned why certain things have happened to me does he hate me and whatnot and I didn't want I didn't want the year to start off like that so I made the decision and I went to church which was actually very good um pastor just talked about uh 2018 letting it be the year that you live it up 
excuse me, you be bold in in whatever you're pursuing. So that would be my message to you guys. Be bold in whatever you're pursuing. Uh, whether that be a relationship, whether that be family, whatever it is. Oh, this is going to be a simple makeup look. It's not going to be anything crazy. Um, that's what I've kind of been going for. Uh, so yeah. Um, there are big uh, changes that are happening in my life one um i am now single a lot of you guys have asked about uh my boyfriend or my ex-boyfriend that was in past videos um we are no longer together for those who have asked um I want to say it was a mutual thing. At first, it was something kind of like I wanted, but never did. And then uh, he made the decision, and I was kind of like, I'll be real with y'all. I was butthurt about it. And then I realized, and then I sat down and thought about like, oh, why am I so hurt? When this is something that I ultimately kind of wanted, you know, but um, it was only, it was almost like because somebody beat me to the punch in a sense. That's bad to say, but it's the truth. Well, I didn't realize that till like it was happening. I mean, after it happened and I actually like sat down and like was worrying like, why am I so upset about this? Blah, say blah. So then I kind of like, after, after all the crying, the weeks of crying, that's why a lot of times I didn't record and why I kind of went missing because I was going through like that personal, um, that personal time too there was a lot going on and um yeah so that happened and then yeah that happened so it wasn't good so I kind of had to de deal with that on my own because uh, you know, I don't I don't really like people feeling sorry for me so yeah um so I didn't feel like posting any videos. I didn't even post anything really on my social medias. Like from time to time I'll post stuff, but I really didn't post anything like pictures, nothing. I kind of went MIA I, and it kind of helped me too because segueing into something else, not just a personal relationship didn't work out, but like business relationships didn't work out as well like I I had hopes um for some some stuff to work out and it didn't uh as um if I don't know if you guys know but some of you guys probably know I had um a channel with one of my really good friends and um I don't even know if we're friends anymore to be honest I don't know I don't know. She said she needed to, like, she said that I quote unquote already made it. So she needed to, like, step out and do her own thing, which I completely understand. But I just didn't understand the whole I made it thing because I don't feel like I have. But that kind of let me sit down and think about, like, where my life is and how blessed I am. Because if somebody... Who knows me like legit knows me thinks I made it maybe I'm influencing people that I don't even know in different ways you know what I'm trying to say I don't know if that makes any sense but if somebody else thinks I've made it and I don't feel like I have 
maybe I need to sit down and just reevaluate my life because if I keep thinking that I don't have and I actually do have, I'm never going to be satisfied. So when she said that, I was kind of taken back. But then I almost had to like listen to her in a sense. Because no, I haven't made the full potential that I want out of life. But I have been blessed. like, And that was my problem. I was never thankful of stuff. Like, I was thankful of things, but I didn't show it to myself. Like, I showed it to others, but personally to myself in the confinements of just me, I was not thankful of it. So, um, I want to be more thankful and more aware of what's going on in my life and realize that I am blessed. I did... I did come a long way. I was in Essence Magazine last year. I have over 5,000 subscribers, which was my goal. Um, I started my line, Nor Brooklyn. And I just want to thank everybody who purchased um, from Nor Brooklyn. There was a little snagging with shipping and stuff like that, but I figured things out and any orders that were made over the holidays or um, in the new year or whatnot, they all have been shipped out. And I just want to thank you guys all for your patience and your understanding in that situation. But yeah, um, yeah, there's just been, most of it has just been personal why you guys haven't seen me. And I feel bad about that because I was talking about how I wanted to be consistent and whatnot, but life does happen and life does get in the way. So, but starting in the new year, I do want to start um, doing more stuff here. This channel, I want to focus more on here, and there will be beauty things there, but the focus will be like on hair because. There's a lot of new products out there and I just don't want to always talk about mine because I I don't always just use mine. But there's a lot of products out there who are starting to have like uh, lines for locks and I want to start doing like product reviews on them for people out there who don't want to keep using the same thing or things that are not working or some people don't even know that there, there are other lines kind of out there so you could try. Right? Um, so I want to start doing product reviews. I want to start doing um, some more knowledge videos about locks. Not too much hairstyles because to be honest, I really don't be doing hairstyles like that no more like how I used to do. I really don't. And that's just the honest truth. I really don't. So I'm not going to sit up here front with y'all. From time to time, I am going to do videos with um, locked lock hair tutorials because sometimes I'm inspired to do hair, but I really don't do uh, my hair all the time, like styling wise. But I'm going to still give you guys like educational stuff like what you should shouldn't do like questions that you guys ask like things like that i'll still there'll still be a ton a ton a ton a ton of block um videos that will be on deck i now i can talk about my second channel which you guys kind of know about but like i keep changing the name or like it'll be somebody else on it with me and Something like that, but this time it's just going to be all me. I took a leap of faith and just put all the faith in me. And in that channel, um, I, I briefly talked about it during Vlogmas, but I changed the structure a little bit. Um, it's still going to be like some vlogs here or there, but it's called That Girl With Locks, which is me, Shay. Like you guys know, um, but I'll be talking more about like 
what I'm really passionate about other than hair is like self-love and finding peace and um, entering the life of a 30 year old who doesn't have her life all the way together but can also help people younger and older than me and you guys can help me too because you can send me questions and send me your stories that you want to share that I could talk to everybody about um so uh there's gonna be vlogs and whatever fun stuff it's just gonna allow me to be just a little bit more creative over there so um I'm happy about that. I'll be doing that over there. This channel, I'll I'll be getting back into my lock envies. I have a couple of people that I already started like looking at as far as like to put on the videos because there is a lot. I've been even though I haven't been posting on Instagram, I've seen a whole lot of like new lock kings and queens that I've never seen before and their hair is bomb you hear me their hair is bomb so we're gonna do that I'm just using the Anastasia Renaissance modern renaissance palette and doing a quick a quick eye look I put a real girl gar on all over my eye and then on my lid I put Primavera and that is going to be the eye look. I'm just going to blend that out. Simple. Put on some mascara and there's it. Uh, yeah, so this i am so sorry that you guys haven't seen me in a while um i just been going through some stuff and my channel is real like i'm always real with y'all but i don't always want to talk to y'all about negativity you know what i mean oh also big plans um i might be moving well I am going to be moving it's not my I am going to be moving but I'm not gonna tell you guys where yet but it's not going to be in New York I'm going to be leaving my humble abode soon and I'm gonna take you guys on that journey like 2018 is the year of believe just believe in yourself and know that um, good things are destined to happen for you if you just believe. If you don't believe, I don't know what to tell you. How do you expect life to progress and be better if you don't believe, you know? I thought about getting like backdrops and all this stuff, but I was like, you guys like the homely, you know, the homey feel, your girl next door type videos. There's a bunch of videos out there that do all that extra stuff. Y'all could go to those videos. I'm tired of comparing myself to other people and I'm just tired of it because it doesn't make me feel good about myself. You know what I'm saying? And I'm also tired of putting out videos and then next minute somebody else putting out the same daggone video. It's annoying. It's annoying. But, hey. Imitation is the highest form of flattery. That's what they say, right? No, but it's annoying. So in the comment box below, um, I thought I got mascara on my face. I would like you guys to put, I would like you guys to put what 
videos do you want to see from your girl in this new year of believing what videos do you guys want to see on this channel and what videos you guys want to see on the other channel don't forget to subscribe to the other channel um, while we're talking about it is <laughs> that girl with locks um don't forget to subscribe to that one um And also tell me what videos you guys would like to see from both channels. From the lock channel and then from the lifestyle channel. Because that's basically what it will be. Lifestyle and whatnot. It was so fun to see my mom over the holidays. I don't get to see her a lot. So when I do, it's good times. And it's good to sit down here and actually get a chance to talk to y'all. Because I really don't get a chance to do that like I used to do. Like, life has been getting in the way. And I feel like I had to be perfect before I came on camera and I just had to sit down and think like you didn't start off that way so why are you pressuring yourself to be perfect like everybody else be Shay and that's what I'm going to do I'm just gonna continue being me hopefully y'all rock with me y'all like comment and subscribe and keep rocking with your girl and see where the funness and where where this journey will take you and I together. You hear me? Oh, I'm so sore too. Cause remember, I told you guys I'm be working out consistently, and um, I've been doing the uh, Tiana Taylor uh, fade to fit and. I am in the last, the last months, the last month, I'm in the third month. And let me tell you, my back is hurting me. Like, I don't know what is going on. My back is killing me as though I wasn't working out this whole time. And I was, but obviously I wasn't working out hard enough. Jesus. I still have my, you guys see, I still have it cut. It's not brushed, so it's looking a little crazy. Yeah, I didn't even realize it stopped, so I don't even know where we are. Like, what I said to you guys. But... I am so happy to be back with my love muffins. I missed you guys so much. So I'm glad that I'm back. Um, get ready for videos, creative videos, fashion videos, makeup, lots of hair, um, all that jazz. Some appearances from the family members. Also on the other channel, you'll just get some motivational talks, you'll get challenges, you'll get fun times, you'll come with me to the museum, you'll come with me as I paint when I'm in a mood and I just sit down and just start painting, you'll come with me. It'll just be a bunch of fun. I wanted to put something on my lips, but... Alright. Well, I wasn't planning on going that bold, but <laughs> we did it. It's there. It's happened. Like, deal with it. Let's go. 
yeah all right <laughs> jesus look at look look at that <laughs> um thank you guys once again for tuning into my video i'm super thankful for all of you guys i'm thankful for 2016 though it might have ended in a, a 2017 though it might have ended in a not so good way it still had some good things that happened. 2018 is just a, a reboot for me. So um, this year will be a blessing. It'll be a lot for me. And um, yeah, I just thank you guys for coming on the journey with me. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. And don't forget to like, comment, I mean, go and subscribe to my second channel, That Girl With Locks. And we're going back to our regular schedule program every Thursdays and Sundays over here. And then I don't know about over there yet. Let me know what you guys think. Should I do once a week over there or twice a week? Twice a week might be too much. So let's let's start with once a week over there, right? Right? That makes sense. Anyways, I'll see you later, Tiger Lilies. I love y'all. Toodles. Uh, crash course. Let me hide the money in the dashboard. Max mad, could you lost the brick inside the Porsche? Goofy with the curb, then asking.